Hello, and welcome to the Void Acoustics walkthrough videos for the BIOS Amplifier Control Software. In this session, we will be covering adding amplifiers to the workspace and discovery of amplifiers on a connected network. For the purposes of this walkthrough, we are working in the live sound skin. However, the implementation is identical between the live and install skins. Under the Design tab, it is possible to add an offline amplifier for designing systems in advance or connecting directly to a live amplifier. When adding an offline amplifier, make sure that you are in the Add submenu of the Design tab. Click on the Amplifier icon in the top left to bring up the option box. Under Brand, select Void Acoustics, then Bias under Family, and select the model of the amplifier you would like to add to the workspace. Under the Details tab, you can select the quantity of the model you would like to add, whether they should be placed in a rack for visual purposes, and how many devices per rack you would like. If you would like to add more models, click on Add, and then navigate to the model required to repeat the process. Otherwise, if you have finished your selection, click on Add and Close. When adding an online amplifier directly to the workspace, or matching an online amplifier to an offline amplifier, navigate to the Match submenu of the Design tab. Clicking on Discovery will bring up a list of the amplifiers currently discoverable on the network. The icon will display the model number and the serial number of the amplifier. If an amplifier displays with a red background as shown here, then Harmonia cannot determine the model. The most common cause for this error is that the amplifier model has not been installed from the marketplace. Navigate to the marketplace and download the model if it is missing from your installed list. More detailed guidance of the marketplace can be found in our other walkthrough videos. If no amplifiers show after the discovery icon has been pressed, open the communication manager by clicking on the cogwheel in the bottom right of the screen. The communication manager will show the active network interfaces your computer is currently connected to, along with their IP addresses. If the interface you are connected to does not show up, make sure that all cables are plugged in correctly and that power is on where applicable. Click on the refresh icon. Once the correct interface is displayed, make sure that the slider under the Harmonia Plus column is set to on, click on apply, and then click on discovery in the main window to discover the amplifiers. Once you have successfully discovered the amplifiers on the network, synchronization needs to be enabled to allow for communication between the software and the hardware. By default, this is set to off when you open the program to avoid pushing unwanted settings onto the amplifiers. Click on the red A plus logo in the top right of the screen, then click on the on button. The background of the logo will go green, confirming status of synchronization throughout the rest of the workflow. To add an online amplifier to an offline amplifier within the workspace, Click and drag the amplifier from the discovery window and hover over the offline amplifier until you see an arrow icon. This will match the two amplifiers. Alternatively, to add an online amplifier directly to the workspace, click and drag the amplifier from the discovery window to anywhere in the workspace or click the add all icon to add all discovered amplifiers directly to the workspace. Once you have added all of the amplifiers required, you are ready to continue the workflow and add loudspeakers to the workspace, which will be covered in further walkthroughs. If you have any further questions or need further guidance, then please feel free to email support at voidacoustics.com or phone the office on plus 441202 where either myself or another member of the team will be happy to help. Thank you for watching.